My name is Mina and I am a first year PhD student in the Department of International History here at the London School of Economics and today I'm actually going to be taking you on a bit of a tour of my favorite bakeries and places to get nice little sweet treats here in London. The city is so huge and enormous and there are obviously so, 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 so many different places that you can go to grab a nice cup of coffee and a nice snack, but I'm going to show you a few of my favorites here today. Chestnut Bakery is super easy to spot because of its gorgeous pink floral entranceway. They have a really wide selection of many different types of both sweet and savory pastries, which is really nice. And unlike a lot of really nice bakeries in London, they actually have a lot of seating available. So you can sit in, they have free Wi-Fi, so you can even get a little bit of work done or read a book while you're there. Chestnut Bakery's signature pastry is these gorgeous stuffed croissants. The flavors change out every single month, so there's always something new to try, and they are absolutely fantastic and definitely something I would recommend. Fortitude Bakehouse is actually located really close to campus. They have a ton of amazing pastries. They rotate their menu pretty much daily, so you never know exactly what you're going to get, but the line is absolutely worth waiting in because everything there is amazing. They are no seating, so I like to grab something there to go for a nice little snack on my way home from campus. The Portobello Road Market area of London is incredibly famous and absolutely worth a visit for lots of cute shopping and excellent food. My personal recommendation is Layla Bakery, which has a nice selection of both sweet and savory options. And they don't have a consistent menu, so they do rotate things around, but that's kind of nice because it means that there's always something new to try. Last but certainly not least is Buns From Home, which has about 15 locations scattered across the city, including one pretty close to the LSE campus. And they specialize in these croissant dessert buns. So the bun is made out of a croissant and then they have different fillings inside of them. Every single weekend they have a weekend special, but they also have a standard menu that is present all the time. Buns From Home is another to go option only, so you can't sit in, but it's a great place to grab a snack and then bring it home to have at the end of a long day. Okay, that is the end of my list for today. I hope you guys enjoyed it and maybe got some recommendations for a couple of new places that you'd like to try. If you have any recommendations, I'd love you to leave them in the comments down below. I will definitely um, check some of them out. I find that, especially when you're new to London, like I am this year, exploring the city through coffee shops and bakeries is a really fun way to um, just kind of like see new neighborhoods, get a sense of what's out there in London, and also have some really nice snacks while you're at it. Yep, yeah, that's it for today. Thank you so much for watching.